is Glen Girl VSG coming into you with my week 48 post-op vertical sleeve gastrectomy update. It is naked November. Um, I am naked from the shoulders up. <laughs> Pretty much not otherwise. But you don't need to know that. I'm totally naked. Um, I am just going to jump right into the numbers, same as usual. Hey, I wonder if you guys, uh, I'm not very technically savvy when it comes to making videos. Um, usually make them on my tablet or on my phone and upload them right into YouTube. But I'm wondering, as I'm watching myself here, like, that's not normal. That whole, like, delayed, do you see that? Like, even my lips, like, as they go, they're not, it's not quite right. If you guys know how to fix that, tell me. It didn't used to do that. Um, anyway, so I started the two-week pre-op diet at 301.2. I weighed in day of surgery at 291.8. I weighed in last week at 199.4. I weighed in this week at 196 for a loss this week of 3.4 pounds. A total loss since my two-week pre-op diet of 105.2 pounds. I left for Phoenix, Arizona last Tuesday. Um, I swear to God I went down there as a 14 and came back a size 12. Um, I have not lost as much weight as this 3.4 pounds um, since I think week 23. Everything, um, I did lose three point something pounds when I was on 3.4 pounds when I had finished the, um, five day pouch test, but gained 2.6 the next week. So I don't really count that. You know what I mean? Um, excuse me. I just had my yummy chicken salad. If you guys watched my chicken salad, um, video yesterday. So, um, yeah, I'm just going to make it a short update, but first of all, since I, oh, by the way, my 11 month search anniversary was yesterday. So that's exciting. Um, I was talking to somebody about it today, um, my naturopath and acupuncturist. I had seen her at lunch, and she was just like, oh, my God, it seems like just yesterday. I was like, I know. Um, so, yeah, I am going to go to Goodwill tonight and see if I can find some size 12 jeans. So that's super awesome. And look at this, guys. Like, this is where I'm really starting to see it lately. Like, not even so much the collarbones, but the collarbones and the neck combined. Like... I have tendons in my neck and stuff, and I'm really glad that this isn't super bad. I never really had a whole lot of double chin, though. I had a round face, but not so much like like that. Um, so, yeah, and let me show you a little bit of saggy armness there. So that's going to be the first thing that's going to go. That's probably the worst of my skin. My, my belly's hanging in. It's all right. I mean, I have loose skin, but this is the worst of it for sure. Um... So, anyway, I've got about 35 to 45 pounds more to go, so it is not, no longer 50 to 60. I cannot believe that. So excited. Um, I guess I should say 36 to 46, but um, I feel firmly planted in Wonderland. Um, my naturopath asked me today if I thought that that 3.4 pound loss was because I hadn't been drinking, but I did drink um, over Halloween weekend. I had probably had some beer tasting um, beer tasting on Saturday, I had a couple glasses of wine on Friday, and I had a five ounce beer taster on Sunday. So, not a lot, but I did drink, uh, for the first time in like two weeks, I think, and, um, no, I did have another glass of wine out somewhere. No, I think that was pretty much it. Oh yeah, I had a glass of wine, um, like, Wednesday night, too, in, in Arizona while I was doing the piano bar with Tessa. So, um, what else did I want to talk about? Oh, yeah, so I'm a size 12. What the fuck? How does that even happen? That blows my mind. And apparently, Cal is going to be sending me some size 8 jeans, which I don't know will work because she's shorter than me, but maybe. Um, and I told Tessa, I was like, I can't imagine I'll ever be a size 12. And she's like, why not? And I was just like... I don't know. Why not? So, we'll see. I mean, maybe 150 will be a size two, to, or size 8. Excuse me. Size 8 is what I meant to say. Um, so, anyway, I still can't wrap my head around being a 12. Anyway, so I had a great time in Arizona. Tess and I did our Q&A videos, which were super fun to do. Um, and we went to Bisbee, Arizona, which is like the southeast corner of Arizona almost to Mexico, like super almost to Mexico, and we had a great time, it was, we were hippied out though, let me tell you, 
Um, as someone who lived in Ashland, she was like, oh, it's like the Ashland of Arizona, but it is like Ashland on steroids. Like, Ashland is hippieville, but also has some, I don't want to say class, because it wasn't like Bisbee was not classy, but they were all hippies. They were legitimate hippies. <laughs> they weren't just like college student hippies that live in Ashland. They were like legitimate adult hippies. <laughs> It was fascinating and amazing and super fun. We had a great time. We went on a ghost tour. We um, had great food. Um, I was a little disappointed in the shopping. I'm not much of a shopper anyway, but, you know, you expect a small town like that to be more shopping. It was really a lot of art galleries. A lot of artists lived there. It was great. The town was really cute. It was really nice. We had a good good time. Um, and then, um, yeah, and then Phoenix was fine. We went to see a movie one night. We went to the piano bar another night. Um, sorry, I got chia seeds stuck in my mouth. I saw my high school best friend Monday night, and then I flew home Tuesday. So that was pretty much all the time we had was, you know, I flew in late Tuesday night. Wednesday night we went to, um, the piano bar and got pedicures. Thursday night we saw the movie. Friday, Saturday, and Sunday we were in Tucson and Bisbee. And then Monday I was with Susan, and then Tuesday I flew home. And then my boyfriend is out of town, so this is, um, I've had some time to myself this week, which has been great. Um, I miss him, but it's nice to have some space as well. Um, even though I spent the whole week without him, um, I always come home like a tornado, and I have to clean and unpack and do laundry, and he, we almost invariably always get into an argument or disagreement of some sort <laughs> as I'm coming home from a weekend or a week or whatever away. And so it was nice to just, like, come home, be my tornado self, tidy up after him, <laughs> and not take it out on him. It was wonderful. So he comes back tomorrow. I'm really excited. We're going to have a really nice weekend. Yay. Um, let's see what else. Yeah, I haven't lost this much weight since week 26. I'm on week four, or 24, 26, 24. I'm on week 40, 48, you guys. It's, like, halfway through, like, basically... Six months ago. It's crazy. Um, 11 month surgery anniversary. That's really all I have to cover. Um, yeah. So I'm super excited. And that's all I have to say. So happy Naked November. I hope everybody is happy. Yay, I am. Okay, so Lauren, we'll just do a little pet. Ah. Since they're there, I mean. <laughs> okay, guys, have a great day. Keep it fly out there. I will see you next week. Bye!